Hi, teacher. What are you Hi, doing? Teacher. Teacher, I just want to know how are you doing? That's the question. Hi, teacher. Hi, good. I guess. Hi. Yeah. yeah. Natural legacy yeah. week one. Preserve it. Don't abandon it. Why do we have to preserve our catcher legacy? It's a critical thinking. It's week one, and we're gonna have also week two. Ladies and gentlemen, please, would you mind taking this uh, note in your uh, beautiful copy books and get ready for the big discussions? Okay. So the question that we are gonna ask now, guys, why? Culture legacy is important. Mm -hmm. To answer this question, I want to take you, my friends, to the chat room to warm up. Cultural legacy is really important because it represents our uh, our way of thinking, our way of living, and it may it differs from a country to another. So I think that it's important to uh, to preserve it. I think also that this cultural legacy is going to be a teacher for our children, uh, the next generation, because they know about their culture, their country, the things that they did in their lives. Okay, so we're back, guys, to our large class. Sirayan, go ahead. You are your number two. Uh, you are number three. So I, I believe that culture should be preserved because it shapes who we are. I believe that a culture is what our grand, great grandfathers left behind. And thus, it is important, and that in in itself makes our community unique, different from others. I think that it is something that has happened in the past, although that does not mean that it should be forgotten. In fact, our past will affect our future significantly. So I believe that it is something that should be should be taken into consideration. Thanks a lot. Thank you very much, Lady. Uh, we go to the dua, please, Binti. Without a legacy, we are not who we will not be who we are now because because of those friendships. Uh, like we're not speaking just about uh he, like uh, uh, historical heritage. We're speaking about um like uh, traditions, cultures. Uh, I don't know, like um, the way we are speaking, our language, and all of this. It's what make us who we are. I mean, I think. It uh, cultural legacy is is an important thing in our life because first of all it helps us to figure out our identity who we are and the second thing which, uh, which i think it's uh, we should consider is uh, when we are proud of our culture when we really consider our cultural legacy we 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 we, we, we avoid being reactive and we are more proactive because when we are not proud of our culture what we will do is we will try imitating other people and trying to get another culture. As a consequence, we will find a lot of reactive people imitating others. So I believe that uh, culture is very important because it reflects the beliefs and aspirations and your identity. When you speak to someone and you tell him that I'm Moroccan, uh, the exact image of Moroccans would appear to him. You will know what you like, uh, in what uh, religion do you believe in, what it is uh, your aspiration. And I want to insist on aspiration because uh, when you go to USA, like being successful is uh, having a lot of money, being uh, rich, etc. But when you come to Morocco, it's more about uh, putting uh, food on the table, helping the family. I want to go to my friend, uh, Rania. Uh, so yeah, uh, I think that our cultural legacy represents the footprints that we that we left behind, what our grandfathers did, what we will do, and what our future will do. But I also want to uh, to add something to what uh, Fatima Zahra said when when she mentioned that uh, our our culture our represents our way of thinking, and I actually disagree with that because I think that um, everyone has his each way of thinking and, um, and that our our culture background our class or our history does not define how we will think everything has a very high value and it is unique sure because it 
but um, it is a kind of uh, an identity that can we that can be introduced to the world like um, um, it affirms our identity as a people because it creates um, teacher love things uh, that teacher help the preservation of uh, this cultural heritage and it also makes us feel that we belong to something we belong to a country uh, a tradition a way of life and um, it also keeps our integrity as a people I think that it is very important to preserve our cultural legacy because as Romaisa said, our integrity as people. And actually, I think that the importance of uh, cultural legacy is not just the cultural manifestation itself, but rather the wealth of knowledge and skills that is kind of like transmitted uh, through it from one generation to another. Yes, you should. Sure. Sure, as you just said that we are in globalization wave, so having no culture just kind of make us vanish and can make us lose our identity, lose the real we. And the only thing that is going to keep us on the news is our culture. Many students already discussed before that heritage uh, conservation is extremely important because <laughs> it's the only thing that can bring us together as a united country. Also, by conserving and preserving our own heritage, we are constantly creating a legacy for the future generations to inherit. We are too busy right now copying off others and we are just imitating them and we're not even thinking about our grandparents or our own legacy. Yes, uh, I just wanted to say that cultural legacy is a part of our history and identity, which means language, stories, music, clothing, and much more. If we happen to not preserve and guard uh, what our ancestors left for us will be losing our ethics, which will result uh, in copying other cultures and it will lead to more problems. <laughs>